I gotta get out of here. <laughs> Can you even? Probably. Oh shit, this is a great area for her to appear, actually. It's a I didn't think of it. It's a fucking endless hallway. Not endless, but... Is it her? What, the phenomenon? The force? Yeah. Maybe. I think that'd be awesome. Is this as fast as you can run out? Okay. I knew oh. it. Wash your hands! No. Yeah, it's her! No. What do you gotta do if the door's closed? <laughs> cool. Oh, is this it? That thing again. Okay. So she's sick of my hiding bullshit. Sick of your hiding bullshit. What? Watch out for bottles on the floor, yeah. Yeah, well. Yeah, well, that's not... Mm. Yeah, well. Well. <laughs> Fuck. I tried. What the hell? Whoa! Whoa. Oh, God! Dem Dementor! Oh, it is her! Look, when I died, I Your turned into one of them. Your kind of whitish, yeah. Wow, okay. So now I'm really con now I'm super interested in what her deal is. Cause it's something that's present in STEM and just cause attacks people. Now I I was thinking about this the other day. If we hadn't triggered her initial encounter in that woman's house, yeah. someone was saying she only appears there if you do that. Yeah. No, if you miss that side quest, you're done. What do you mean? Like, if you miss that that a, a initial, like, uh, uh, fucking thing, you never see her again. So this fight doesn't happen? It's a completely optional side quest. Okay, I thought that was just the only optional part, and then she just appears... No, no, no. ...in All... certain parts of the rest of the game. And she's kind of dumb to hear, though. You're, like, clearly through a grating that you could be seen through. But yeah, no, she's, uh... I think you just need to leave. Oh, uh, yeah. That's, that's been every other encounter so far. Yeah, because shooting her... If she's, like, a, a mega ghost... Oh, I thought there was going to be a staircase here. I thought there was, too. Just run around. I, I don't know what it... Was, was that it? There was no railing Yeah, yeah, yeah. She broke the railing when she threw the thing. Uh, she's impossibly fast. Like, there's... the. I don't think even think it's that. I think it's just like it just turns into a cutscene faster than you think, and then you're just dead and can't do anything. Yeah. No, but uh, she's she's a super super optional cool thing girl that gives you a optional upgrade uh, when you beat her. Okay. Which is super good, and I super want super. I don't know what the upgrade is, so I'm interested. It's. it's I, I'll see it when I see yeah, it. Yeah, you'll see it when you see it. Or not. Oh my god, there was a path right there. And I just didn't see it. That would have made it much easier, wouldn't it have? Her her music makes me think of like Resident Evil 1. It sounds like the, the original version of the basement. Yeah. Mm. Before it became clown farts by a liar. Right, I forgot. I, I guess you have to go in the center, yeah. Yeah. How this is gonna work, I'm not sure. She's like, mm, I have a feeling he, he kind of, yeah. That's me. Did you see that? Yeah, in your old uh, outfit, too. Oh. She looks fed up with this. Yeah, this is what, like, fourth or fifth? Uh, I've encountered her. At l this is at least the fifth time. Well, because sometimes we never even saw her. Oh, she gets to cheat, huh? Sometimes, yeah. Is that how that works, lady? You just get to cheat? I'm a super-powered monstrosity.
Yeah, she does have... 100%. Watch oh, it saved video. the game there. See Watch that? Watch it doesn't fall on you. <laughs> <sighs> this is awesome! It is. This is a great stealth sequence. Watch out for the bottle, I don't know if They're you everywhere, it. man. What? What was that? That was a mistake, is what it was. Oh no! That's big mistakes! Oh, I'm glad to say. I like that there appears to be no way to ever see her face. Yeah. I've never I mean, been able to see it, even with- a, I mean, her hair did fly off and you could see it, but the it, the camera was really far away. And when You'd she's really uh, when she's active in the environment, her head is tilted in such a way that it's always, like, mostly obscured. Mm. Even when she's all pissy and shit. Man, once you give me an enemy I can't fight, it kills me over and over. Seems like it. Because I'm so strong. Good fight it. Very confident. Yeah, I hit the R1 button to get to cover safely, um, and that super killed me. All right, let's try this side. Wait, has she fucking yeah sealed off the whole fuck? That doesn't seem like it's gonna move. Okay. Boy, I bet this section's super hard if you don't have uh, the stealth upgrades, huh? Maybe. Oh my god. So, my main thing is I can't figure out where sh where the game actually wants me to go. Yeah, so once you see you, there's really nothing you can do. And these load times are brutal. Bruh. She's like Kodako. <laughs> Remember? Kodako? Yeah, the fusion of Kayako and Sadako. Because Kodako makes me think of a ghost that takes your photo. Yeah. With a Kodak camera. Yeah, but it's like... It, well, it's like the, the creature boss from before. Oh, I have to move forward and trigger that. And then she shifts the room around again. Maybe. Yeah, she's actually shifting the room to make it more annoying for stealth. I guess that's one of her special abilities. What a I jerk ass. shift the room around to make it more annoying for stealth. Look at all those fucking bottles. See, so where does it want you to go right now? That's blocked off. That is super blocked off. That's blocked off, too. That's... You have to go... Also blocked off. And that's what we Ah. Uh. Yeah, okay, I see that. Aha. Uh -huh. She shuffled it around just enough that I could escape. Oh, that, man. Was that? No, it wasn't. I was so close. I was so close Run to- Run for it. Yeah, running for it's the option. Yeah! Yeah! yeah. Why is it after me? I didn't do anything to it. What does it have it? to do with this place? Looks like I'm safe. Like yeah, you're safe in Beacon Hospital. Well, it's a pretty I'm nice version safe, of Beacon. Look at this important shit. Huh? Oh. Top psychological examination report at the bottom. To be kept on duty and observed, the information gained from his experience in STEM could be invaluable. It's been posited the STEM immersion can have long-lasting residual effects. Castellanos is unique in that he's entered in left spin without standard preparation or memory overwipe. We can learn a lot about the mental repercussions of Sam used simply by letting him go about his business. It will continue to track Detective Castellanos' mental state via our mandated therapy sessions. Report any finding. Oh my god, they were using his fucking therapy as data for STEM. Of course. Mobius oh. were using me as their guinea pig. Long lasting residual effects. They knew STEM would scar me like this. They're sure giving us lots of reasons. You know the to fact that this is shoot whoever at the, the end of the game. The fact that this is Beacon makes me think that Sebastian somehow like poisoned the system. Or, like they used the research wrong, or poisoned it further. Okay, wait. I can't open that. I need a key. Yeah. Ah. Letter from that, the chief. That, there's the, the the key from the police chief. After you. Jim here, just a quick note to give you an update on the Castellanos Beacon situation. 
are sending Sebastian in for mandatory counseling. The Beacon incident needs to be kept under wraps, and the good detective is our only loose end. We have many operatives in KCPD, but not enough to ensure total information blackout. Fortunately, our staff psychologist is on the organization's payroll. Once you determine how much Castellanos knows, you can easily instill self-doubt oh, through these fucked. sessions. That's fucked. When we're through with him, Sebastian won't even be sure what's up or what's down. Not that he needs much help. He's been stumbling. He's been bumbling through his assignments like a zombie. Poor son of a bitch is obviously having trouble dealing with whatever happened to him in there. I don't care. I almost feel bad for him. I've known the guy for over a decade. Fuck you. It's like he's a different person now. But that's the price of progress. If you want to make an omelet, you got to... Br- I, before I read that part, I was wondering if he was going to say, got to break an omelet. Got to break some eggs to make an omelet. They were right under my nose the entire time. This is this is even more like Umbrella than I thought. Oh, yeah. The like with out. irons on the payroll and stuff in RE2. Whoa. Cool. Beacon. Wow. Ruvik. All that shit. I bet it's not Beacon very complicated, but that's a neat effect. Oh, yeah, it's just I haven't a really fucking... Seen, it's just like an FMV, uh, like a FMV display, yeah. but still, you don't really see it that often. I feel like the only place you really see it is in, like, Remedy games where they put it on a TV screen. Can't get out. Still this. Can't leave. Nothing changes. Okay. That's... Sebastian from one. Watch out, there's blood on the ground. Yeah, so I, I see feel it. like someone's gonna grab you. My fault. It's all my fault. What the hell is this? Can't move on. Can't Oh yeah. There's some evil within one. The source of my pain. Is me. The part of me still stuck in STEM. Never getting out. No. I'm wrong. Oh, yeah. I will get out. But without you. Whoa, okay. So, yeah, using. using what? Sebastian as like a template. That? Fucking. It felt different than the others. Poisoned the whole system forever. Like something changed. Something changed. There's, there's a nice feel, little photo slide. Good. I feel so good. I should oh, shoot more things. My trusty revolver. Sorry, did you just get a revolver? I yes, I did. Time. It's the revolver from Evil Within One. Hmm. Finally free. And a slide. Wait, was that connected with the side quest? Yeah. Wow. All right. So the revolver is the reward. Uh revolver. Man, As there's a, sure a lot more hang like I said early on, I was like, yeah, I don't imagine you're gonna get a whole bunch of handguns, but I guess you do. Revolver has less clip ammo and all that stuff, so it doesn't fully carry over all the upgrades. Yeah, but but, for, but fortunately you feel the thrill oh, of it reloading. Oh it does it does carry the the upgrades. But you feel the thrill of reloading and you've never felt it. You notice that he shoots differently with it? Yeah, a little bit. So the thing with this thing is that it it's like does it slow it fires more slowly, but it does way more damage. Like it's a significant upgrade. So that's not the upgrade you were talking about, was it? Yes, it was. So you only get the revolver if you do it. That's if, right. If you do her. And now Sebastian is free of his pain. I guess. All right. I didn't know about now. that part. That's a fucking dope side quest. That is, but I it can't... doesn't even make doesn't even seem like a side. Yeah, quest. I can't believe it's relegated to side content. That seems nuts to me. Um. I wonder if I feel good means so, anything. So else we in the killed game. the source of the monsters. Too bad there's a billion of them. Too bad there's also a wax monster and a crazy okay, uh, priest from Madden Town. You're normal. Anybody up here? And not, the- not yet, at least. There they are. <laughs> 
All right, it'll be easier to come at him from the other side. If you can. Nobody over there. Could well, throw a you could throw a bottle, too, if the positioning calls for it. I haven't been able to get that to work properly a single time. Oh, you know what? Depending on if he has his back to you or not. Yeah, you can get him. No. There's two. Oh, shit, you're right. Maybe you should throw a, a, a boodle. Let's try the bottle. Uh, make, maybe you should back up just a bit so you don't fucking hit the edge of the... Well, here's hoping. Alright. Let's see how long oh, I'm, I'm gonna get this glad, I'm glad that it gave me the really, really oh, long animation. You put bottles left. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Thanks, Bottle. Bottle, you're the best. Oh, Bullet Cascade, combo two. Cool. Cool. So, was that just a handgun upgrade, or was that for just firearms in general? Uh, handgun, just... Bullet Cascade. Yeah, uh, no, the Bullet Cascade's for everything. Okay. But, because the handgun has, like, a shit ton of shots in the clip, I'm gonna see it most often with the handgun. What's up, motherfuckers? No one's in here. There's a resonance. Yeah, Hoffman found some shit. I'm super afraid we're gonna find Ruvik in here somehow. Cause if if I wouldn't mind it now. Well, cause I if think memories be draw stuff in, memories. that's really powerful. For what? Medical pr uh, medical syringes. Yeah, that is actually because we've been full up for a long time now. How many more was it? Two. Yeah. Forty percent of Union populace has succumbed already. Did she just say forty percent? Oh yeah. Less than a day ago. Within hours, we began to receive reports of lost emerging in staggering numbers. They're everywhere now. Twenty percent of Union's populace has succumbed 20 already, okay. and they're actively hunting down and killing whoever is left. It's a nightmare. It sure is. Week, there will be no one left in two weeks. We've lost contact with Mobius. We're trapped in here. With the lost. With the capital L lost. The entire Union experiment is doomed. We're all doomed. I'm sorry. Great. I told you what the name of the main core of bad guys were in the first game. Do you remember? No, I forget. The Tormented. Oh, yeah. The Lost is not much better, but I guess it's slightly less edgy, so it's fine. Huh. Like, that makes me feel like that's what a metal band calls their fans. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Like, Slipknot calls their fans maggots. But like, but like, fans of Evil Thing games are called the Torment. <laughs> oh, did I have to actually touch the door in order to trigger the, the brain thing? Maybe. Run, Seabass, run. Because I'm clearly going to have to go through that, you know the guy that's on the slab? Yeah. You have to go through his brain. I guess. Yeah, there we go. Damn it. Damn it. Well, luckily, there's a guy right over here. <laughs> nice try. No, it doesn't seem like this is what we gotta do. What was that? I heard some shit. And you hear moaning, too. Yep. All right, where you at, fuckers? So that's a new encounter. I was there earlier. Huh. I mean, I felt like a door opened. There. Well, there he is. That's weird. Just out in the open? Yeah. He's gonna turn around pretty soon. Or never. Whoa. No. No, too scared. I think he, I think he, oh, okay. No, I actually, you could have done it, I, there are certain animations that they do right before they turn around, which is kind of awesome because, like, that makes you think they're going to get you, but it's actually fairly specific. Oh, 
Chip, it, it activated him, but no, he's he wouldn't have a chip because he's just a union guy. No unity, huh. Well, I'm willing to waste one ammo on this. I, I don't, I, you know, I think it would be. Um, Wow. I think if you need to get a chip from someone's brain, it would have a prompt. Or, you know, it would have, it have that bright blue uh, icon on it. The, 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 that glowing blue thing that all the... Yeah. Everybody has. You check your map. Is there, there's nothing indicating anything on your map. No, right? there's nothing. All, what's, all what's, it's that, what's that thing in the middle? That icon in the middle? Oh, that's the mirror. mirror. Okay. No, it's, it's, it goes, no! And that's I know. Like, and that's like... Mm. Because it has to be a fucking employee. Alright, let's try the morgue. Maybe I missed something in there. Yeah, I kind of feel like that could be it. Unless it was that guy in the suit. He seemed really important. Yeah. Okay. Nothing. That. I think that one's laying out there. Yeah. There's something behind you, but even then, I don't think. Yeah, I'll go check the guy in the suit again, and then worst case scenario, I'll check the guy they were eating up. Oh, what's this? Yeah, Is it nothing. Uh, no, that's right. It's nothing. Absolutely it's nothing. It's a huge fucking load of nothing. Oh, hey, medical syringe. How convenient. Uh, yeah, that fancy asshole in the suit. Probably all his fault, really. Not sure. He gets guts ripped out on the. Now he's kind of fine, but yeah, that's okay. Nothing so there. Nothing there. I mean, what was the other path that wasn't where the ghost girl was? Near identical. Guy in a suit. He's not that special then. I thought he was a special guy in the suit, but I guess, I guess he liked him. Sure Is there not. anything on the second floor that I missed? Maybe. Let's uh, check the guy that they were eating. <laughs> what the hell happened there? I don't know. That looks not great down there. Hell no, it doesn't. It looks extremely Anything? not great. Yeah. Oh, there was another door. Fuck. Okay. I was thinking either that or there was like a vent that we missed. Sure enough, I've discovered the path forward. I... It's another big morgue. Holy shit. This looks like a big important room. How many of those do you think are going to get up? One. It would be a good scare to turn around and for them all to be standing up. Remember there was that scare like that in uh, Freddy vs. Jason, where there's all these children with, like, bandages over their eyes, and they wake- there you go. Where the fuck am I? And <laughs> look what we got here. You know, Mara's actually a pretty big area. It just looks- I'd it, like to visit. It feels kind of small because of uh, all the hallways, really. Alright, so we're gonna go through here, we're gonna get some stuff, we're gonna- Eat this guy's fucking brains. No, we're gonna eat a chip in his brain. Hey. It'd be great if Sebastian was like a big idiot. And he was just like, "Yeah, eat the chip." Then you That's up, the ticket. That you meet up with Hoffman, and you're like, and she's like, "Fucking what? Yeah, why? Are you okay?" Our worst fears have been realized. The lost phenomenon has hit Mobius Ops. Oh no! We've theorized the transformation as a result of memory overwrite, but no operatives have been overwritten. We need to be able to quarantine and terminate an effective Mobius Op before he could transform. Perhaps his exposure to so many lost corpses in the pit made him susceptible to whatever is. Oh, it was the guy before we read his file. Aww. Perhaps it's merely a coincidence. We're, we're harvesting his Unity cerebral chip in the hopes it will provide new data. Removal of the intact chip is possible with the extraction device. It's relatively simple and automated. Merely place the subject on the gurney and enter the code 0128. This guy's chip yet. I can use it to get through that door and find Hoffman. Gotta find Hoffman. You know, before I hit 0128... There was another number there. I'm gonna hit 0602. Yeah. I like that. Oh. Well. Okay. Damn. Let's see what happens. But that, oh, Jesus. I want this guy to wake up right before it happens. This Sebastian could be like, oh god, oh sorry. 
Depending on how strong that drill is, he might not be able to get up. Y yeah. And <laughs> it's like no chip detected. How deep are those fucking chips? That's a little deep. Like, Sykes said they were subdermal. That's in your brain. Ugh. That's huge. Thank God he's already dead. <laughs>